viewers welcome to my channel this is Geeta. today we'll be solving a question from bank pay 2009 question paper so in a test a candidate secured 336 marks out of maximum marks x if the maximum mark x had been converted into 400 marks he would have secured 192 marks what was the maximum mark of the test so 336 marks out of x marks when it is converted into 400 marks this x is converted into 400 he got 192 from this we know that when 36 is decreased to 192 so this x value would have also been more than 400 like for sure 336 will not be out of 400 because for 400 it's just 192 therefore which is more than 400 like x should be more than 400 so when one side increases the other side also decreases its direct proportion so in direct proportion x1 by y1 equals x2 by y2 so which is x1 cross multiplication x1 y2 equals x2 y1 so this is how we will find for the direct proportion so therefore here it is 192 into x equals 336 into 400 so which is 192 times x equals 336 times 400 so by solving this we can find the value of x so x equals 336 times 400 divided by 192 so to simplify this so 4 times so 4 times 100 is 400 and here 4 times 4 is 16, 17, 18, 19, so 8 times is 32. Again, this can also be simplified using 12 times table directly if you want. So 12 times 4 is 48 and 12 times 1, 2 is 24 and difference is 9 and 12 times 8 is 96 and 4 times 1 is 4, 4 times 7 is 28. So 7 times 100 equals 700. So the maximum marks for the test was Sounded. Also be done with a different method. So when this question goes like this, so 336 marks out of maximum of a marks x, so which is 336 out of x and when this x is converted into 400, the marks he got was 192. So even with you can start with this step and just do the cross multiplication and find the answer. So it's still going to be the same. Just it goes again. Yes. For watching, if you have any doubts, please let me know in the comments.